these have another month just about to grow. Here's the queen. She's right here. As a beekeeper, you inspect the bees to check on the health of, of the young and their overall health of the colony. I'm looking for eggs. Full of eggs. Okay, so they're eggs. That means we've got a queen. So last year when I was doing my first inspection after the blueberries, that's when I noticed that in fact the, the larvae were not healthy looking. They were the wrong color, they weren't white. Um, they were sort of yellow to starting to be brownish looking. They weren't clearly segmented. Didn't smell healthy, didn't look healthy. So from there, I've just really felt um, depressed and downhearted uh, because my yard of 45 colonies, they were all sick. And I'd always thought it must have been my beekeeping that was at, in question. And then I, it was, I don't know, something about that day that I realized, oh, this happens, this happens every year. Um, but this year it's, it's, it's worse, way worse and, and way more obvious. And then I started to ask around other people if they'd had difficulties uh, since the blueberry pollination. And I found out that actually beekeepers were finding that their bees were not healthy coming out of the blueberries. also contemplated walking away from agriculture last year because I thought well it's just such a hard life for the bees but then I began thinking actually I owe it to the bees to stay in agriculture and try and see if there's some way we can mitigate all these negative factors that the, the bees are facing.